Keys? EV? Very exciting. Oh, it's roomy. For, for a car that's a meter shorter than a Camry, it's got an incredible amount of interior. It really does. Yeah, it's got a lot of headroom. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. The guy's 6'6", six, six, he fits in here. Okay, got the box. All right, so just turn it uh, off. Turn it to on, that's really all you need to do. Um, and that's it? That's it. It's running. Okay. Have you driven an EV before? You know um, I have a Prius, so that's close to okay. A little, little different feel. Um, there's really okay. not too much to know. We've got very strong regener regenerative braking, which is okay. going to feel yeah, different at first. Okay. Um, essentially, it's all on the accelerator. As you lift off, you'll get full braking. Okay. Um, you've got full control of everything from full positive to full negative force. Okay. Right in the middle, you can coast. Um, most people like it a lot after about a minute. Okay. Yeah, I can see how that could be. Uh, it'll it'll slow down pretty dramatically if you just if you're used to driving an automatic and you take your yeah. foot off. And well, it's kind of like if you use uh, braking mode on the Prius too. Okay. It does that. So. Okay. All right. So. Uh, this is your uh, direction selector, down, okay. down for forward, yeah. reverse, uh, towards you for neutral. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Watch out for the crazies because nobody's watching where they're going. Yeah. Well, you know, when you come in, there's a spot to check your brain in. I don't know if you know that. They give you a little ticket. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird not having it idle very way back, but um, I must say. Uh, yeah, there's no creep at all, actually. Yeah. It'll just sit there until you give it some throttle. Keep back there in your stupid hydrogen car. <laughs> I didn't realize they were letting people drive it. I thought they were. They aren't. The same woman who they uh, made drive it last year. Somebody told me that they were. They drove one. Maybe it was one of the other ones. Oh, wait. wait. What's the top speed? It's about a hundred. Oh, depends oh. on the gearing. I think this is geared to go about 97 or something like that. You almost never use me too far. Yeah, in general driving, you really don't, unless you're stopped on a hill or something. Right. <laughs> uh, so in terms of good amount of pickup, yeah, that's a lot of torque. The efficiency of the motors, like it's there zero for eight inch. Uh, in terms of 200 horsepower. Wow. In terms of the efficiency of the motors, they're like a sweet spot speed where you get the best uh, amount of distance for the juice, I guess. There is, and it's a complicated map, but in general, it's really good. It's, it's you know, 85 to 90 overall, and it's, it's good, you know, really to worry about it. So when can the common man purchase one? Depends on how rich he is. <laughs> <laughs> I said common man. Common man already has one. <laughs> Yeah. Well, nobody thinks that a $70,000 EV makes sense. We're not even making much money on them at that point. Yeah. Um, the plan is to build uh, 25 or so of these. We mostly learn how to build better cars. And right. We, we're not hemorrhaging money in the process. So. Okay. Um, Do you have any orders on there? Uh, yeah, I think we've got orders for uh, mid to low 20s, and we built roughly half of those. We've got a six or so month queue right now. Um, plan is to build a bunch of these, a bunch of something else, because uh, actually Toyota's not making these anymore. Right, yeah, I'm going to change the shape. There we go. Go right up the hill. Yeah. Tearing up this hill here. Okay. Tearing, you say? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's pretty tearing. Whoa! <laughs> Try not to kill your car. <laughs> <laughs> it's fun though. I'm impressed. The official route is off that way. Okay. So are we going the official route? You're <laughs> welcome to ad lib a little bit. Okay. I think there's too many other people waiting. Well, I'll go the official route for now. Uh, so anyway, after after that, we'll build a run in something else, which will probably be cheaper. We haven't nailed down what that will be, but we're getting close. Will uh, it be a similar form factor? Uh, it'll, it'll probably be a small car. Small and light is the cheapest range you can buy. Right. <coughs> and uh, at that point, we're intending to partner with an OEM and actually build cars from the ground up, and that's where things get 
Chin for it. Yeah, because it's the economy is scaling. Yep. And there's so much, so much, so much of the effort is just labor. Sure.